Hi Aquarius. It's Aaron Scott here. We are tapping in with an art channeling this month. We're taking a look to see what forms, symbols, pictures, archetypes want to come through uh, through me as a vehicle for this Capricorn new moon cycle. So beginning on the 16th of January 2018, extending through the month, what is it for Aquarius suns specifically that is your egoic evolution? What's, what's occurring? What's coming up in your psyche? So we have here essentially what emerged immediately was a tree and you can see that we're looking almost from this unusual perspective. We have the tree roots down here at the bottom that are quite large, and the top of the tree is quite small, as if we're looking from uh, the base of the tree up to the top far away. So there's this perspective element here, which I find interesting, actually. It almost reminds me, too, of like an early 70s album cover. It has that kind of funky vibe to the imagery. So there might be something, because late 60s, early 70s was this revolutionary phase of civil rights, women's rights. And it could be that for some Aquarians out there, that is on your mind. There's There's a lot of uprising going on on the planet, and it could be that... For a lot of you out there, you're tuned in and wanting to maybe even contribute. And you can see here that there are lips developing, a mouth developing, kind of behind the tree. It's big. And the the expression on the mouth is grinning. It's, it's an easy smile. It's not stressed. It's not sarcastic. It's grounded. It's easy you know and for me there's some great joy almost like a grounded matured joy that a lot of you are feeling with regards to growth that is going on in your life tree certainly represents growth and those are big roots there and because the focus of the tree for you in this image is the roots the large roots what I would say, Aquarius, is that you feel satisfied at some level with what you have already established or set into place or are creating some root structures, whether it be home, whether it be family, whether it be work or creative projects. There's something that you feel satisfied with this month. Okay. Now you can see here that kind of the top of the lip I accentuated and also the crease under the lip above the chin I also accentuated there are branches developing up top and you can see here below the branches where I'm drawing now down on the trunk you can see that I drew a knot on the tree and a knot there's different kinds of knots on trees but this particular knot is representing like where a branch had grown but then maybe died and fell off or got destroyed it came off the tree and for you what I get especially with the satisfied expression sitting behind this tree that you have a history of maybe you know something that you and you can see I'm drawing around that knot now but maybe you know that, you know, you had some growth that happened earlier in your life at another time and it didn't work out and that's fine. You know, it's, it's as if you're able to have a level of deep understanding about the perfection of the things that are emerging. Because the things that are emerging are the right things. Now, Aquarius, what wanted to come here underneath the mouth, there was this spiral formation that wanted to come. So this is like in the cleft of the chin, okay? I did look up the reflex, or excuse me, the, um, I guess it would be the reflexology. I mean, it's like the acupuncture and acupressure map of the face that I ended up pulling up after I did this channeling because I wanted to see what that part of the face 
represents in Chinese medicine. And it does represent kidney bladder down on the chin. Now you can see that the same spiral is emerging above the lip. And that has to do with spleen, pancreas, stomach. So the fact that these two aspects of the body, the physicality of the body, above the lip and on the chin, came up to be highlighted for you, and because I was called to pull up this acupuncture, acupressure chart, there might be some health issues with bladder, with kidney, and possibly with stomach, pancreas, and spleen. So be mindful of your health this month, Aquarius. Be mindful if you have, if you are growing certain projects or work goals or f family goals, friend um, events, whatever it is that you have planned for this month, even though you have this, some level of satisfaction with what's emerging, there could be some underlying stressors that are creating some level of physical stress on the body. So drink a lot of cranberry juice, perhaps, for the bladder and the kidneys. You know, uh, drink clean, lots of water, cranberry juice, like I mentioned, and um, maybe a clean diet for a while especially with the stomach, spleen, and pancreas coming up as well. So there might be some sensitivities, but just be mindful. And, uh, yeah, these are what I'm seeing. These items are what I'm seeing coming up for you uh, in the cycle ahead. I'll see you next month.